Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Leah Lauren, and I'm back at it again with another video. If you are new to this channel, hey girl, hey, my name is Leah. I make videos, story times, hauls. I do a little bit of this, a little bit of that. So it's like for the kids, you know the vibe. And if you're a returning subscriber, hey friend, how are you? I hope you're doing wonderful, fabulous, beautiful, amazing. So you guys, today I have a haul for you. Um, and I hope that it's one that you enjoy because I haven't shopped in this place in a kind of a long time. Um, so today's haul is gonna be featuring Pretty Little Thing. I haven't gotten anything from Pretty Little Thing in a super long time. Um, and it's not because because I don't like their clothes anymore. It's just sometimes I take breaks from companies. But I'm back to shopping at Pretty Little Thing. Um, one of the reasons why I went back to PLT is because I find that a lot of your clothes does fit my aesthetic. So whether that's the more like edgy side of my aesthetic, which is wearing blacks and solid lines, like a lot of um, geometric shapes and stuff like that, or it's on the more feminine girly side with lots of like detailing as far as like the, the shoulders and the sleeves go. There's a lot of like um, ruching in their clothes a lot of chiffon satins laces anything that resembles like feminine wear you'll find on the plt website so i feel like that's one of the reasons i went back to that website um but today i am going to show you a few things that i got some of them are graphic tees and others are like a little bit more dressy i will say that they're mostly tops and i only got i think like two pairs of bottoms from them so be cognizant of that everything that i wear will be on this side of the screen so i'm going to show you guys what i am wearing i'm going to show you what it looks like on me and i'm going to put all the details on the screen and also in the description box down below for your convenience and for reference i am five seven and a half and i'm about 175 pounds okay so the first thing I want to talk about are these jeans that I'm wearing and these jeans are going to be mostly paired with almost every top that I have except for the last two. One thing's for sure, two things for certain. When it comes to me, I'm going to wear mom jeans. I'm going to wear mom jeans. I love mom jeans. I find them to be very, very comfortable. I love how roomy they are. I like that it's not super tight so I don't feel like constricted in them. I like that you can wear them with anything. You could wear mom jeans with a really nice shirt to brunch or you could wear them casually to go shopping. You could literally wear mom jeans to almost anything. Anything. mom jeans are that girl of jeans like I don't really like jeans that are tight and I don't like jeans that are like flared but mom jeans is like a happy medium for me like I love them so of course I had to get a pair now these mom jeans are of course distressed and I love the distressed look when it comes to mom jeans just because I feel like it gives it a very like 90s element and a very 90s vibe these jeans are in a size us 10 um, I did I want to say size up but I don't think that's necessarily true because I have gained a lot of weight over the past year for more more reasons than one and so I do feel like although I was an eight before in bottoms I'm probably definitely a 10 now I don't know how long that's gonna stay true but right now I'm a 10 so that's what I got and these fit me perfect they fit like a glove I don't have to wear a belt with them they're not too tight I could sit comfortably they're just very roomy and I feel like they're an essential pair of jeans so the first shirt that I paired with this is of course a graphic tee if you know me you know that I love graphic tees the thing that I love more than graphic tees is coats okay and I don't got none in this home but I did get some graphic tees so the first tee that I got is this PLT teddy bear graphic tee that's orange and I love it I think it's so pretty it's so fun it's so like comfortable um, I love the um, teddy bear aspect on it because although PLT is for grown women for the most part it does give you kind of like a childhood like feature and it makes you feel a little bit young the next graphic tee that I got is this Biggie Smalls graphic tee um, I'm from Brooklyn if you didn't know I'm a Brooklyn girl and of course I love Biggie like I love Biggie I grew up on Biggie my dad loves Biggie so I I I'm a fan and I always have been a fan um, and so I had to get this shirt when I saw it I really love the colors I love the red I love the blue I feel like they're very very vi vibrant they look exactly how they look on the website it's not washed out at all yeah all that yeah it's a stone um rib tee it's a crop top it's really pretty I love the way it fits and it also has like this um the string detailing on the side that you can make the tee shorter or you can make it a little bit more narrow so that it gives you more of that hourglass look the next shirt that I got is a shirt that that I got specifically for these jeans. Um, I got this shirt because not only was it oversized, but it was textured. Um, and when I looked at the picture, I wasn't really sure what the texture was that I was getting. So it was kind of like a wild card for me a little bit. Um, but I really liked this shirt on the website because of the way it was oversized, but the way it was dressed on the model. So the model on the website kind of has this tucked into some mom jeans with some heels on. And it looks like she's going to brunch or she's going to like a meeting with a company or something like that. It's just really cute. Like it's giving up scale vibes but like casual you know what I'm saying it gives like that girl you know what I mean like it's effortless with a shirt a t-shirt like this um I tried it on a few different ways so of course I had it like the regular big way but 
it wasn't giving the girls nothing so I also tried to tuck in half the hem of the shirt into my pants just like the model did and that was cute but the thing that I like the most it's taking the top and tying it I thought that this was the perfect look for this top because of the material and the texture and just the feel of this shirt I feel like tying it makes it a little bit more fun and flirty and playful again you can use this shirt in any way that you want to I think it'll be really cute paired with like a simple gold necklace and some simple earrings but also like um, some heels or something like that I feel like this is a look just an entirely look if you want to wear this with some shorts in the summer some like denim cutoff jeans girl girl eat them up eat them up the next top that I have is actually something that I got in this type of wear and also in another type of wear and what I mean by that is when I saw the print for this top online I had to have it and when I saw that it came in more than one design add to cart you ain't gotta tell me nothing but twice because one thing about me if I like it I'm gonna get it in another color if I like it I'm gonna get it in another color like period it's the same for designs I feel like with pretty little thing my favorite thing about the website is the fact that you can see something in one design and one like um one print and it could come in a different type of like cut so for example this top is a long sleeve oversized top but I also got it the same exact print and kind of a halter top you know what I mean so you could get the same print that you like in more than one different type of top so that you could wear it for different occasions I got this one because I thought that the design was so playful and it was so fun. I've never been one to get bold colors, geometric shapes or nothing like that. But again, I am stepping into like this kind of new place where I'm playing with my aesthetics a little bit to see what I like and what I don't like. And so as far as this one goes, I was like, I have to have it. It's so cute. It's so fun at cart. Again, this is something I feel like you could wear to brunch with some um really like mom jeans and some heels or you could wear it to a lounge or something like that. You could even wear something like this to the club. If you wear these with some jeans, like some really not jeans, if you wear these with like some dark shorts and some heels who's 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 seeing you who's seeing you not a damn person like this is just so cute I feel like anybody who knows fashion would know how to wear this and style it I personally also see myself wearing them with some like chocolate colored like um jeans or some pants I just didn't have them with me but that's exactly how I want to style this shirt so again, um, I also got it in kind of like a halter top, but I didn't try it on in this video because I think it's too big for me. I got it in a size eight, but because of the way the chest is in this top, it's definitely too big. It's no surprise to anybody that I don't have a big chest. And so I feel like I should have sized down when it came to this top. So I will be returning it, but for your convenience, I'll put a picture on the screen of what the model looks like. Again, it's almost the same exact design as the top before this. It's just in a halter top. So the next thing that I got is this green torso renaissance top My boyfriend's watching basketball forgive me forgive me um anyway so the next thing that I got is this renaissance top and I really really like it again I feel like it's very feminine it's something that you could definitely transition into nightlife I see me wearing this with something like PU leather pants um and some black heels with a nice like YSL bag or a Chanel bag or something like that if your hair is pulled back or you have it in a low ponytail girl it's definitely elevating the look I feel like this is the type of top that can elevate any outfit because of the way the hemline is and the way the neckline is, it just gives it more of a classy feminine look. I love the green and the black. It's just beautiful. It reminds me of a painting. Like I love, 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 love this top. Now, I will say that you could get this in a size um, smaller than your regular size because I got it in a size eight, which is usually my size in top. However, it is a little too big for me. And that's simply because this is supposed to fit like a corset, but it's too big because it's my regular size. Size. So if I would have gotten it in a six, it would have fit perfectly, but I didn't. So there's that. If you're gonna get this top, just take heed that you should um, get it in a size down from your normal size. Now, this next t-shirt is a t-shirt that I'm wearing right now. It is a um, Colorado print t-shirt. I don't know what it is with Colorado these days, but I've really been liking their mountains on graphic tees. I don't know. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's because I wanted to go skiing and I never got the chance this year. But I love anything Colorado printed and this is the second shirt that I've gotten with a Colorado print in the past two months. Anyway, um, there's nothing really much to say about it. It's long sleeve. It's graphic. It's a t-shirt. Um, I will say that I ordered this in a chocolate color, but it's giving more off a green. I don't know if you guys could see this on camera, but this is giving more off a green color. It's not really giving chocolate or maybe I'm bugging like, let me know like this look chocolate to y'all. 
a gift chocolate so the next thing that i'm trying on here is this kind of like um sweatsuit that i put together so the top of it is a pink thong bodysuit i was really nervous about this because in the past i've been burned by pretty little thing bodysuits um i've gotten them in my size which is a size us8 and they have not fit me they've just been really tight for some reason and i just don't understand so i was very very nervous about this however i was pleasantly surprised to find out that this material was very very stretchy not only was it stretchy but it was very flat as well I love me a um a bodysuit that's kind of like in this shape I forgot the name of this but I really like it because I feel like it complements not only my arms but my shoulders as well and it went perfectly with the joggers now the jogger sweatpants I love sweatpants from Pretty Little Thing one thing about me I'm gonna buy some sweatpants I live in sweatpants now these I got in a size 8 but they are a little bit too big for me and when I say this I'm saying it liberally because I'm still gonna wear them anyway I do like my joggers to fit me a little bit more oversized just because I think that they're more comfortable and I enjoy them a lot more when they're a little bit bigger especially in the winter because then you can like layer it and stuff but um if you want your joggers to fit a little bit more tight you should definitely size down so i could have gotten away with the six but in hindsight i am glad that i got the eight instead now the next few things i'm going to tell you about are things that i never got to try on in this video for more reasons than one so the first thing is kind of um this chocolate self-love print tee the reason i didn't try it on in this video is simply because i could not find it um but this is what it looks like on the model it probably will fit me normally um and and yeah um so the next one is this new york graphic tee the reason i didn't try this on is because it's white and everybody knows once you get a white tee dirty it never goes back to being fully white you know what i mean so that's why i didn't try that on and last but not least we have this stone wrapped jumper shirt um i have worn this before and the reason i didn't try it on in this video is because it's hard to get on it's complicated it doesn't go on like a normal you know like a normal sweater it's weird because the top is not like lined there's no real back you have to form a back with this shirt and i didn't have any help at the moment so i couldn't put this shirt on it's simple as that i just i couldn't put it on i don't know what to tell y'all but yeah um that is all for this video if you like this video make sure you like comment and subscribe subscribe and join the gang 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 because if you're watching this whole video you might as well stick around follow me on my socials that is snapchat twitter instagram and tiktok that is in the outro and also in the description box down below call me be me if you want to reach me i love you guys so much and i'll see you in the next one bye y'all shout out to everybody i had fun